Morgan Jones is dead, and you were dealing with somebody else now. Welcome to Knock Pro Nation. Welcome back, guys. Jarrell here. And I'm Josh. And we are fresh off of watching the season premiere of Fear the Walking Dead. Yeah. And we want to give our thoughts and review the episode, guys. What an amazing episode it was. Oh, it was so good. It was so good. It's a, one of the best premieres that we've seen in a long time for Fear. Um, the, the whole mission with Morgan and the new character, Isaac, which, you know, unfortunately passed away. Yeah. But I love where... You kind of mentioned in our reaction, he kind of like reminded you of Rick. I mean, yeah. he was so like uplifting. He was motivational and he was, you know, inspirational, inspirational. He, yes. He kind of turned on Morgan for a second, but he's doing it to get back to his wife. Yeah. yeah. And he was also dying at the same time. We didn't think he was, but after the fight, he was kind of holding himself and we were like, did he just get bit? And then we finally, we realized, no, he was already bit. And he was just trying to get back before he yeah, turned. I especially love the mission because it was him all along that basically is saying that that lured Morgan there, not just right. to save his wife, but to replace him yeah. to build this community that that uh, if you're looking at it, looks like it'd be pretty legit. I mean, you have a huge dam blocking mm -hmm. one side of you. Yeah. And he also did it because he was part of Ginny's group and he saw one of Morgan's tapes which made him change his mind to see that, okay, I don't need to sell my soul away to Ginny to have these items. I yeah. can go out there in the world and give, give back to the people and try to help people like Morgan can. I love that part of it. And it was kind of weird. So, like, when he mentioned Morgan's name, I thought he mentioned it like um, uh, that uh, the bounty hunter mentioned it. Well, he kind of, I don't think he said Morgan. He said Mr. Jones. Yes, dude. You know what I mean? So yeah. I was like, yeah, how did he know his name? Then I thought maybe Morgan, uh, was as he was walking and telling the story about Ginny, I was like, well, maybe he was just telling a story about Ginny. Mm -hmm. And then he brought it up and he was like, no. I, I thought it was so good. Yeah, you know? I loved it. I And... Uh, let's talk about the bounty hunter. I mean, I, I love him, man. <laughs> dude. He was amazing. So good. He was amazing. Um, Trying to read, uh, he's like, yeah, yeah, dude. He was like, he was like <laughs> peering through your soul. I could tell. I was like, you better have the best poker face in the world, or he's gonna sniff this. Um, out. He reminded me of uh, Winston from from. Uh, <laughs> Ghostbusters. Oh yeah, he does a little bit. <laughs> he yeah. looks a little bit like him, but yeah. uh, amazing actor. Oh, great, absolutely amazing. I thought yeah. he did that role perfectly, and uh, I was actually a little disappointed that he went so quickly. I was and, too. It, you know, I thought we were yeah. going to get more. I thought we were going to get the bounty hunter tracking Morgan throughout the first half of the season, um, but it doesn't appear yeah. that way. Yeah, I, I probably didn't think it was going to last the whole half, but maybe no, no, a no. few episodes. Yeah. but you knew that. That was eventually going to be the inevitable end. You know, those two were going to get together. They're going to fight, and one of them's going to die. But I, it kind of, it kind of fits for it being in the premiere to basically get Morgan to change who he is. And hearing him on the radio talking with Ginny, Morgan Dude. Jones is dead. You're dealing with somebody else now. Like, oh, it is odd. He's not. I don't. He's not clear. He is a completely different Morgan. Now. Yeah, he is in a position where uh, he wants revenge, but revenge in a, in a way that that brings his people back to him. Strategic. Yeah. 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 I don't uh, it, like dude, that. <laughs> that final radio communication where like she threatens him and then he comes back with that. I'm like, it. dude, it was awesome. And he was watching the whole time. Yeah. He, and. <laughs> He was wearing the Bounder, <laughs> Bounty Hunter's hat. Entire ensemble. Entire outfit. Amazing. <laughs> but guys, let's talk about the major plot point here of, you know, Morgan does not have the cure. He has gangrene. But that is very interesting because we were kind of thinking like, yeah, Morgan doesn't have the cure. It has to be something with his wound. It has mm -hmm. to be whatever the walkers are sensing or he's possibly somewhat kind of dying. Yeah. That's what they're sensing. And that... I love how they, they turned it into that because yeah, absolutely. You, would th you would then think, well, if you get bit by a walker, why isn't that deterring them? You're, yeah. you're dying as well. It's a different bite, but it's a different wound, you could yeah. say. I but. actually thought it was pretty clever of AMC to almost give it a, 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 an innuendo of that, 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 look, is he a, does he have the cure? 
Like yeah. it, it was pretty uh, uh, intelligent marketing, right? Yeah. Like, but uh, obviously, uh, I hate to say I called it, but I did. You did in the reaction. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I don't know, I don't know what I said, necrosis or something. And you're like, I think it's gangrene. Yeah, and yeah, uh, but it makes sense though. Like, if you're it, 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 if you're ordered a meal, right? And you you order a steak that's well done, and you don't want it well done, or or something that's rotten and and expired. <laughs> are you as a human going to eat that? Right. No. no. So is is a walker going to eat rotted flesh? No, yeah. it wants to eat good flesh, pure <laughs> <laughs> living flesh. Yeah. yeah, I thought it was great. It was great. So the the main mystery right now is. Who saved Morgan? Yeah. Who left that note? They the initial it, saving. The initial saving, yeah. yeah. They heard the radio communication from his last communication. They were in the area. Um, you know, I, I I don't know if it would be Sherry. I'm, I'm kind of thinking it could be mm -hmm. because she heard Dwight's radio call and she called out to him on yeah. the radio. So we're kind of thinking she was in the area. Um, does she have medical experience to patch him up? He, she just patched him up decently, not great. So you yeah. could say that could work. Um, I don't know who else it could be. Yeah, uh, I, I don't know. I'm going to go but, for Sherry right but, now. But if you look at the advice that he gave that person, that he tells Isaac, he says he told the person just live. Just live. Not the person. He told everybody. He that's told he was, that's, that's right. He told about. our yeah, group yeah. that. Yeah. Um, the person but, on the note said, you still have things left to do. Mm -hmm. Basically saying, I heard your call over the radio. You need to live because you still yeah. have things left to do. So I, I, we don't. we know Sherry does not know Morgan. But maybe she feels because she, heard, if it is Sherry, she heard that message over the radio it was very inspiring to her. Mm -hmm. And she's like, yeah, dude, you're awesome. I'm going to save your life. You have things left to do. If it's Sherry, it could be someone else. But that's my initial yeah. theory right now. But yeah. um, that's going to be cool. That's yeah, going to be cool. I, I'm, I'm, like, I'm excited, guys. I think that this was just the, the best way that we could have kicked off this season. And the, the intro was different. It it's right. still the same music, yeah. but it had the yeah, it had the it had the bounty hunter in there, so we know that the next intro is not going to have him in there. So I, I wish they would change the music. <laughs> I don't like it. Some of you, I know you guys have seen when we've done fear uh, fear videos where I've put in the original fear oh, sound God, that, that I love and that this. was awesome. And they had a couple other ones too that were really dark and ominous, but. Yeah. Uh, Either way, a fantastic premiere for Fear. We are hyped for this. Yeah. We've been pumped for this, but we just didn't know how eventually how these anthology type episodes are going to go, but I think they're going to go well. Yeah. I we, really think they're after would, this, I'm my, I'm feeling a better. I I would say we were skeptics, right? Yeah, like yeah. we we didn't know how this was going to turn out um, just based upon how the last couple seasons went. Not that they were terribly bad, but this guys I'm on. I'm. I'm pumped. Yeah. I'm pumped. We are so excited for this. So let us know what your thoughts were of the Fear Walking Dead reaction and the premiere in the comments below. If you enjoyed the video, give it a quick like. Feel free to subscribe if you're new, and stay tuned for more. I'm Jarrell. I'm Josh. We're not We're out.